I'm out here at Truman Stadium. I've got the new Jeff Hall, the Cuz. And this bad boy is 27 and a half ounces. I've heard nothing but awesome things about it. Part of the Wilson D. Marini Louisville Slugger family. We're gonna give it an opening compression here test. So again, it hauls these bat right around 1450 to 1500 is the compression, which is about in line with really what the Hyper Z's and the other Slugger bats are. Uh, we're gonna start taking it out of the, we're gonna start taking some swings with it now. Way out of here. This thing, 28 swings, absolutely awesome. You really done good, Halsey. That was a terrible swing. My weight was stuck back on my back leg. I hit her a good 305. Nice job with the cuz, baby. Woo! Hey, that was my best swing with the uh, the cuz. Once. <laughs> I got my timing on, beautiful bat. Nice ride out of this baby. And I keep practicing. I'm gonna catch up to Jeff in <laughs> real soon. That's a 27 and a half. Did it feel heavy or light? No, it felt light. I swing it normally a 26 and it really didn't feel a difference. And of course the graphics are all Jeff Hall, aren't they? Always the yes, pink. Yes, the pink, pretty pink. So you, you would endorse that for oh, Jeff Hall? Oh, heck yeah. Heck yeah. <laughs> I might even sign it for Jeff. You let me swing this Jeff Hall. Uh, this is this is a, what, three-piece bat? Two or three. This, this sucker has, I never, the ball jumps off it, even with a old hitter like me, but uh, it uh, has a, the most unique sound that I've ever heard on a bat in recent years. It's got a real springy feel to it, doesn't it, off the barrel, that's what I thought. That's a 27 and a half ounce because Jeff Hall's bat, and I like the half ounce load. It, to me, it, it seems uh, about perfect. Uh, you know, you were swinging good here at the end, Dave, getting a lot of top arm extension. Did that bat feel uh, okay to you as far as weight-wise? What yeah, would you recommend? Uh, uh, to be honest with you, I like a lighter bat, but I think I could get used to this bat. Uh, Certainly a 26 and a half might would be, be something perfect for me. At. I think a 26 and a half. I'm going to finish out my review of Jeff Hall's Cuz. Of course, I'm swinging uh, the Demarinis, and I prefer the 13 inch uh, uh, Paul Sadler, Paul Stanley model. Although Larry Carter, I've swung for the last three years, I feel that bat. For me, I can still, when I get a good snap, can power it up a little bit yet at 65 because I'm a big guy, and I feel like that bat gives me a little bit more distance. But uh, each bat's phenomenal. But Wilson is in TPS, Louisville Sluggers, in our family here at Wilson. So I'm going to finish up my review of the Jeff Hall. The Cuz I like a lot. Just a lot of great things about it. 27 and a half of swinging here with the step up. I like the half ounce unload. It's got a very springy feel. It came down very quickly from an opening 1500 PSI on my ASA tester. Sitting around 1300 now. The thing is just really hot after about 130 swings. That's up the last few swings here, trying to get a good drive and snap. It falls out, didn't even catch it very well. There's a huge sweet spot on it, way up the hill. That's a good jump. Way up on the trees on the left side. This thing is just phenomenal. You guys are really going to like this. Now, I think it's got a pretty soft feel for seniors. Dave was hitting the grade too. Way up in the trees over here at Springbrook. Again, for me being a guy 65, I still got some power and I'm a big guy, but my legs are about shot. I had back fusion, I need a new knee. And this bat here, I'm able to compress this bat 
I think real easily because of the springiness of the barrel and the sweet spot on it. I think this bat's appropriate for anybody who's up to 70 or into their 80s because this bat's very springy. The sweet spot's huge, 130 strings to break in. I don't know the longevity of it, but save yourself $8 on a knob cup is phenomenal. Great job by Louisville Slugger and Jeff Hall making the cuz. Fans, Jeff Hall here. Hey, got the cuz bat in. Uh, I know I've done a, uh, the last video I've done, we did not have the finished graphics. This is actually the bat with the finished graphics here, and you can see we filled it in here with the little the little black uh, design here. So this is it. Been getting a lot of questions about the launch of the bat. This bat will be launched July the 31st this year. Uh, Pre-orders, we're gonna be you're gonna be able to pre-order this bat sometime in mid-July. If you want to pre-order this bat in mid-July, hit up your LS advisory staff members in your area or you can reach out to me at jeff at eastcoastathletics.com and the promo cards here's a little promo cards here they're easy to walk through you get 25 percent off with these uh with these promo cards right here's our asa bat our asa bat we've already got it out there we're taking pre-orders on it as well if you're interested in a good asa bat uh, again it's jeff at eastcoastathletics.com hit me up Hit your local advisory staff guys up, 25% off guys.